Hello and welcome back to our channel. I'm Linda from the Rosy Life Planner. If you are new here, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Um, if you have been here for a while, you know what I'm gonna say. Hello, lovelies. <laughs> Let's get straight into it. I know that you have all been waiting for this unboxing for quite a while. Um, uh, the boxes left probably a few weeks ago now so probably most people have already received them so let me show you what is inside the coffee and planning 2.0 themed box first of all if you have never um, heard of our shop before or have never shopped at us at our shop before we do monthly subscription kits which are stickers and bits and bobs for your planners and then we have this sort of box which is a themed box and every month we release a new team and then two to three months after that team it goes shipped so you get a box every month but it's not the box you bought the month before if you know what i mean this coffee and planning i think went on sale in january or february and now it was shipped out at the end of march so i think it was january it went on sale so just so that you get an idea currently open at the moment is the bare necessity boxes which we only have one box remaining so whoever is lucky enough to get that box that one leaves at the end of april next one um i, I should mention all of our planner boxes always sell out so um the next one after that is the dreams do come true box it's a fairy tale box it's sort of like themed around princesses and um, just making your goals a reality and then the next team after that which so the dreams come true box should leave on May end of May and then the next one is planner girl summer vacay and that leaves at the end of June you will be getting the summer vacay then close to the start of July so they are the three current boxes that are open at the moment for um so you can purchase them we have a limited number every time of boxes it ranges from 75 to 100 because the items need to be made in advance so we don't normally have oh, i normally buy a few extra items just in case for instance something gets lost something gets broken something like that but in general we don't want to have stock over after that any stock that does uh, go over we put it on our website and then it goes um, fast after that launch let me show you you cannot anymore buy this box this box is already gone and i will be bringing back the team again because so many people this is the second box if you want to see the first one you can go to our playlist and team boxes but this one is the coffee and planning 2.0 and this box as i said already left last month and the current one is the bear necessities box and it is a box full of cuteness it's bears and teddy bears and just pink and cute and yeah but this one let's get into it now and let's show you what for instance comes in a box such as this so first of all i'm going to open the box and um, it normally comes in a recyclable plastic bag so obviously mine hasn't traveled so it's like this but i'm just going to open mine with my tweezers along the seam here it was raining when i brought this in last night from the office so there's a few splashes on mine which should not be on yours dun, dun, dun. okay so when you open your coffee uh, box or any box usually from us you will have the team always here on some kind of sticker and i know that many of you cut this off or take it off and put it into your planner so you can do that and i know some people also use this label too so let me show you what is inside the box 
So after you remove the tissue paper, um, we went with this brown sort of map material because more and more I try to, um, in the shop, incorporate things that can be reused so that this box is recyclable, it's cardboard, and then this sort of tissue paper, you're able to reuse it as like paper for your planner, for scrap journaling, for that type of thing. So I try that our packaging is like some way related to planners and that you're able to somehow incorporate it into your planning routine. So that's why for this paper, there was a sticker just sealing it, this beautiful green coffee cup. So that was the seal sticker. And of course I didn't write a thank you note to myself, but to everybody who got the coffee and planning box, I did write a note to you on the back of the card. My hand was killing me after I wrote all the hundred <laughs> cards for the coffee box. That was tough. But as I have mentioned before on Instagram, that at some point it won't be possible anymore to write every single um, thank you note with my hand. I actually have a problem with one of my fingers. It's quite numb and it's probably from holding the pen on uh, like for long periods of time, for instance, when you're writing a hundred thank you notes. <laughs> But um, as long as I can still do it, I'll try to do it. So <clears throat> I'm going to move this candle out of the way because this is really light tissue paper and it's so beautiful. It's so like antique looking that I really think this, I'm going to use this a lot in my planner. So let's get into it. I can't wait for you to see this. Okay, da da! This was the coffee and planning box. Let me take you through it. First of all, let's dig in the back and take out the inserts. Um, if you buy a box from us, you will have the choice to have inserts to your planner size. As far as I know, we are one of a very few planner companies at the moment who offer the inserts to size in subscription kits or themed boxes and we do that and it's really important for me to do it so I try my best to always continue that so for me I took A5 Unpunched there was your name dashboard and it was in this beautiful coffee brown and your name obviously <laughs> if it's if, if, if it's not Linda, it was your name that you had put on your order. The next one is this Nothing Stands, stands Between a Girl and Her Coffee, this beautiful dashboard. And then I love this one. Um, it has like little sketches of coffee cups and then little hearts all over. And then there is this design which is the same design you will see on the washi tape so there was that and then there was this coffee hard vellum and um, both of these are like a tough vellum so these two and then these were like a lighter vellum so 160 and 110 gsm vellums so there was five vellums in that Next up is this really cute handmade bow. Okay, so this is the planner bow that came with the team box and it has like a little cover on the back of it of checkered and this is super cute. Let me just get my planner. So let me just pop this on the top. Oh, like, look at this. Yes. Oh, yes. So the brown was so because of the coffee. Um, but it that is just so my vibe right now. Um, so, yep. There is the brown bow. Next, we have these coffee sticky notes. Um, as you can see here and they are like like a notepad and they're not uh, like transparent so you can actually pop them into your planner almost like a sticker and write on them so really love those the next thing is our die cuts which 
can't wait to show you these. These are super cute. So here is this and it's ah coffee. That is really how I feel when I have a coffee. I'm not joking. It's just like oh yes. So there is this one and then this beautiful pet tape sticker. Love it of that coffee cup and I love the colors. That is just yep. That's my that's my vibe. Next there is these heart stickers and they are in a latte color and they're actually transparent sticky notes so you can put them on your planner and you can see underneath them so you can see what you've been writing underneath again on the backing card i have put some of the artwork so that you can also cut around it and add it to your planner the same with all our backing cards as you can see so hopefully you will get some use out of them. They take quite a while to design always these backing cards. So I hope that you're able to reuse them in some way. Um, but we do need to use backing cards because they protect the products in the journey. A lot of you live so far away in America or Australia. So we really have to protect the products while um, they ship. So next is this dreamy washi tape i've been waiting like as i've mentioned to you over on instagram lovelies i never use the products that i'm making for you before you have gotten it and um, it's really important for me that you don't see it in my planner or anything before the time especially the themed boxes sometimes with the kits i have to try out if the sticker looks well or if color matches but with the things you won't see like with the team boxes you will never see that I have used the washi tapes or anything anywhere so that you wouldn't know where they come from but let me show you let me zoom in on this if you can see it okay it's oh now it's focusing look at how pretty this washi tape is it has the little coffee stains and then the gold washi uh, the gold um, coffee stains too and then the beautiful floral part um, that matches the dashboard so this is the washi tape that came with the box again exclusive to our shop and then let me show you what should I show you next if you saw our last video I was using one of these um, we had literally about one left over and I just put it into my planner in the last video to um, show you how to use it but here they are and they are have the same design down here as the washi let me see if you can see it and it's a 30 day habit tracker and you're able to like let's say you want to drink two liters of water or go to the gym and um, so you're able to mark these off as you go i color mine in pink <laughs> of course i love pink that is those next is the pens that came with this kit so normally each box has around 12 items then some of the items have like two items like a pen or but i'm not sure if this color is coming up on camera but there is a brown pen and a green pen and they are these beautiful vintage sort of colors when you write with them. And then they have the protection seal on the top. Let me show you, this is the two colors. If you see them, they are like this, quite a deep green and brown. And the brown is really vintage brown. So I think the pen's names are pretty accurate and they are 0 0.5 gel pens. So let me show you what is next. Okay, where should I begin? The next is our journaling card set. I think we've become pretty known for our journaling cards, bows, magnets, <laughs> those sorts of things. Um, but let me show you these cute cards. So here you have, coffee is always a good idea. 
a bad day with coffee is better than a good day without. Then I am fueled by happy thoughts and coffee. And if you see, it has the metallic effect. And then down here, coffee. And then here it has this metallic effect, coffee and planning cafe. And then this is like a linen card. I don't know if you can see the texture, but it's really textured. And it's the same girl from the Ah Coffee. But I love that. So that was the journaling cards. As I said, the kits come with like 12 items, but it doesn't mean that the item itself could be like 12 cards. <laughs> no, it's like, this is like one item. So um, it just depends on the kit and everything is different in every, in every box, but generally we aim for 12, depending on the cost effectiveness and etc. So the next item is this beautiful brown pen loop. I'm definitely adding this to my planner now. This part is brass and some leather, and you can put your pen in here and add, slide that into your planner. So that was one of the gifts. Next, we had this brass clip. I don't know if you can see it. It says coffee and planning and established last year in 2023 when we first done the kit. So it's like a little limited edition item. We have a few left over that will be on the website when this video goes live. So if you want to grab one still, you should go there. There should be a few there still. So it's super strong and you can use it to hold your planner open while you journal and it is brass. So as you can see, it has our name here, the Rose Life Planner. Oh, I love that. So, and it's really heavy. Next is the planner charm. So it is, let me see, I'll just take it out of the packet so that you can have a look. So it's this little coffee cup. It's like a takeaway coffee cup on the end of this charm. And actually what I was thinking with this is if you don't have like for instance a traveler notebook or you can hook this actually to the end of a clip like for instance any paper clip and clip it to your planner that way so there's loads of ways to use these so that is that and what should i do first the planner magnet or the stickers let's do the planner magnet so lovelies here is the planner magnet. We always do a custom magnet with every box. And this is the custom magnet for this box. I love it. And it has magnet backing and you can just add it to your planner pocket. I love the shadow on the cup here. Okay. And the custom stickers. Let's see them. Our coffee stickers are always like you love them. So I have to show you these. So here is the first sheet. How cute is this? This is one big sheet with these gold foilings and they are washi material. And here is these quotes and some coffee scenes. And then here is the coffee shop with some other coffee related items. And then my birthstone is a coffee bean. How cute is that? And here is just brewed happiness in a cup. Love that. And then here is some baristas. And then, how cute is that? I love this little banner. And this coffee shop is super cute. If I can get it to focus. How cute is that? 
and then here is some gold features on the coffee bar and here is that girl again with some and coffee time is me time okay lovelies so that is all the items let me show you what it looks like when it's back in the box okay lovelies it is all back in the box and this is what you would have received when you got the coffee and planning box so i've gone through it all now and as i mentioned i have added all the items to our website um, any of the items that I have left over there is only a few so um, if you do want any of them you will have to be fast with getting them but um, if you did get the box I hope you enjoyed it I got so much feedback from you lovelies that um, it really warmed my heart and I'm so glad that all the hard work paid off <laughs> Um, that you got something that you really enjoyed so thank you so so much for tuning in if you liked the video please remember to subscribe and like the video because it really helps other people to find us and um, the more lovelies we find the better really i just love growing this community thank you so so much for tuning in as i said i will link the items below i will link to the collection on our website and i guess happy shopping and thank you so so much for tuning in i hope you really really love the video and thank you again i'm completely humbled that so many people ordered this box thank you thank you thank you just thank you so see you again in the next video lovelies bye